I'm Emily Peters. I'm the Recreation Special Uses Permit Administrator of Gunnison Ranger District. Well, I joined the Forest Service in May here in Gunnison. I first got hired on as a permanent full-time employee um, and I worked the last summer with the Backcountry Trails crew doing maintenance trail construction, fun outdoor stuff, <laughs> uh, and then in November I transitioned to my current position um, because the fellow who had this position before me retired um, and they needed someone to fill it and finding me is a big deal to me. But once I had my job at the Forest Service, which is the hard part, is getting in. <laughs> Um, it's, you can kind of move around into different positions, especially if you're moving laterally. Mm -hmm. Um, so I was able to get into this. I didn't really expect it, mm -hmm. um, but it worked out, um, for the best. So it's pretty Seems good. Like it. Yeah. Um, A day in do? the life. Um, well, I deal a lot with the public because um, the outfitters and guides that I permit aren't um, for service employees or other, they're just regular folks who own businesses in the valley. Um, so I get a lot of calls and emails from my outfitters asking questions and things like that. Right now is my busy administrative season. Um, all of our new permit applications were due February in February and all of my I like dealing with the public, dealing with my outfitters, um, mm -hmm. getting to know them and their business mm -hmm. um, and getting an opportunity to deal with challenges, find solutions. Creatively, mm -hmm. so I like that part. Yeah. Um, it's also the hardest part of my job is trying not to step on anyone's toes while making everyone happy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm kind of the face of the Forest Service to most of the outfitters. Yeah, that's uh, pretty. I cool. mean, we have all sorts of different kinds of people who are our outfitters, from you know hardcore mountain bikers. Rides mm -hmm. that are no, made for beasts, <laughs> um, and then we have kind of the more old school outfitters who do hunting and horseback rides. Um, mm -hmm. A lot of those guys who are older gentlemen um, don't have the internet or email, <laughs> um, so we get a lot of handwritten notes from them. Yeah. Um, and yeah, old school kind of <laughs> stuff, um, but they're great people who have been doing this stuff for yeah. ever, mm. and that's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, and then every once in a while, some people will get upset mm. about something that they thought they could do, but they're not supposed to do, mm. um, and then they yell, <laughs> but then they usually get over it. <laughs> Our yeah. ranger district, Gunnison Ranger District, um, we have about, I want to say, 60-ish, give or take, um, special use recreation permits. Mm -hmm. um, that's not even the other land use permits that we have. That's just recreation. Um, mm -hmm. So... It's an important part of the management of our specific district. Mm -hmm. um, it also goes into just the general economics of the valley. Mm -hmm. um, Gunnison and Crested Butte are um, tourism-based economies, and the outfitting and guiding fits into that. Um, mm -hmm. We have to 
manage how many people are doing certain activities in certain areas, um, like Crested Butte, mountain biking in Crested Butte. It's a very intensely populated area with that activity and yeah. you know if we just let anybody do whatever they wanted up there it would be it would be crazy there's lots of people whenever someone wants to propose a new activity or new um, use on the forest in the recreation realm uh, it comes to my desk and then I review it for sort of kind of basic stuff like it's not illegal it doesn't involve gambling and there's no they don't owe debts to the US government those kinds of things mm -hmm. um, and then I sort of use the recreation team uh, to look at trail use develop rec um, if it's in the wilderness I involve the wilderness um, folks handy um, to get Sort of the wider scope of what it looks like, um, and then I involve my supervisor, which is Aaron Drendel, um, and he's like, "Oh yeah, that's usually a good idea, or maybe we need to pump the brakes on this." Um, but ultimately, the yes or no comes down to our district ranger. Um, he's the authorized officer, as it's called in all of our permits. Leg work happens here, signatures happen up there. Uh, yeah, the yeah. Forest Service is, is a interesting agency. Mm -hmm. And this this office, this Ranger District, is is pretty cool. There's a lot of good folks and yeah, seems like it. Uh, there's a lot of interesting things going on. Mm -hmm. So 